Hello friends, myself Dr. Sachin Marda, Surgical Oncologist, Robotic Surgeon from Yashoda Hospital, Hyderabad. So in this video, we will discuss about the radiation therapy and what are the advances in radiation therapy like uh, proton therapy or IMRT, IGRT, cyber knife. So first of all, what radiation therapy is? See there are in cancer treatment, there are three types. One is surgery, one is chemotherapy and one is radiation therapy. So in radiation therapy, what happens is the high intensity rays which will kill the DNA and in turn the cancer cell will die. So it will stop the progression of cancer cell that is called as radiation therapy. Now uh, traditionally radiation therapy is used to kill many, treat many cancers but there are many side effects also. But day by day as the, as the research is developing and new modalities are coming up, we are trying to reduce the complications and side effects of the radiation therapy. And very importantly, normally the conventional radiation therapy goes for 6 weeks to 8 weeks. But with the recent advances, we can taper down the treatment say for example, 1 week or 5 days or 3 days also. So first of all, one new modality is coming up that is IMRT or IGRT that is intensity modulated radiation therapy or image guided radiation therapy. What it is? See there is a special software where the radiation has been guided by through this software. The software will identify only the tumor area and it will try to deliver the dose into that tumor. It is like precise laser treatment. So wherever we point it, it will go and damage the cell there only preventing the lateral or collateral thermal damage. For example, in brain, it is very important structure. So if there is a tumor of around 2 centimeter in the brain or in the lung, we have to kill only to that area because if we, there is a damage to the surrounding area, that could be a hazardous. So with this IMRT and IGRT, we are able to focus only to that area preventing damage to the surrounding area. Second is the duration of the treatment. For example, initially 3 to 6 weeks, maybe for 3 weeks, maybe 2 weeks and maybe 3 days. That is called as cyber knife therapy or stereotactic brain therapy that is SBRT uh, treatment we call it as. And one more new modality has came up that is proton therapy. In case if there is a recurrent cancer or in pediatric tumors, childhood cancers where the radiation therapy does not work or there are so many hazards of radiation therapy, we use the proton therapy. We use the natural hydrogen ion or H2O ion to kill the cells. That is a, that is a new way of treating cancer with the proton therapy. But these are cancers where Sometimes we use the treatment of radiation after surgery or sometimes along with the chemotherapy or radiation or sometimes only radiation that is called as uh, only radical radiation therapy or adjuvant radiation therapy or sometimes palliative radiation therapy. Different protocols, different organs, different stage. We all discuss into the tumor board meeting that which particular patient, how much they have to get the radiation then and then we plan it. So these are few latest advancements in radiation therapy. Uh, all these uh, new gadgets are there in our armamentarium to give the exact dose at the exact time, exact way, the way we want preventing side effects and improving the patient's well-being, improving the quality of life of patients, reducing side effects and toxicity and these new machines are really helping us in a long way. Thank you very much.